Today we are working on Excel Expert Lesson 5, the fifth lesson using conditional logic functions. I know after the last lesson I didn't really want to start this one, but here we go. In our formula to award the gold designation if a customer has more than 25 booking and spent more than 75000 in travel this year, wouldn't it be fun to spend more than 75000 so select cell F5 and enter, and I am going to copy Control C. I'm going to go paste this one. Copy this formula down from F6 to F29. Using this formula, only two customers have qualified for the gold membership. Try a different formula to see how many customers would qualify for the gold designation if a customer had more than 25 bookings or spent more than 75000 in travel this year. So we're going to change the formula. So select cell G5. Boom. G5 and enter if... D5 is greater than 25, so on and so forth. And then copy it down from G6 to G29. Mark that as answers. You can see that we got more customers that qualified doing it that way. Try a third alternative formula to label any customer who has spent $75,000 or less in travel this year with a bronze designation. The formula can therefore be that bronze thing. However, you can also reverse the logical test using the NOT function. So select cell H5. H5. And enter this formula that would designate them as bronze. And then copy that down from H6 to H29. completed worksheet should appear similar to this. You see they're either gold or bronze. And you see in mine they're gold or bronze. So mark that as answered. Submit. And this completes using conditional logic functions.